of girls who practice year round for competitions across the country earned a spot in the opening day parade. The Q Kids dance team used their moves and energy to get the crowd pumped up for the game. Angela Ingram explains how a shot in the spotlight is building confidence in children. <laughs> Before the festivities, a dance group called the Q Kids warms up, practicing their moves and finding new dance partners, including another dance team from Claremont County. The girls practice each week. Now they're ready to entertain Reds fans in the opening day parade. It's just fun to be in the parade because it's like my second time being in a parade for the Reds. Showtime! The dance team has been a part of Cincinnati for 30 years. The founder, Marquisia Jones-Woods, started the team to give young girls something positive to do. And you only get this good by putting in a lot of hours on the dance floor. We practice almost every day and we got to get it together if we want to do it. A lot of work. They practice three to four times a week and it's two or two and a half hours practice time. The crowd was into it. Adults and children. Workers stopped to watch the girls. The team even got Cincinnati's finest to move. But the coaches say it's not just about dancing. This team keeps them safe from dangers on the streets. Game related activity. A lot of different things they can get into if they wasn't doing this drill team. A lot of negative things. All the discipline and drive pays off for these young ladies who dazzled a crowd of thousands. We come to show up and what? Show out! Show up and what? Show out! In Over the Rhine, Angela Ingram, Local 12 News. Well, the girls practice at the Lincoln Center in the West End, and so far this year, they brought home 16 trophies from competitions in other states. Wow. Congratulations. Very talented and so much energy. Big 